Hey guys, I'm Nick, aka Thornley Nix Games, and some of you heard I was now using Adobe Premiere to edit my videos, and thus, you wanted to know my Adobe Premiere export settings. Well, it's a very, very simple in my mind. Um, you know, obviously you go to File, Export, to Export, but this is a tutorial on how to do that. It's a tutorial about this right here. So let's go ahead and walk through this. Format, I use Windows Media, WNV files, because for some reason, YouTube loves them. I don't get it. You obviously want to export audio and video as well. After that, I don't do anything in effects, but in video, I use the Windows Media Video 9 Advanced Profile 1080p 1920 by 1080 Under that, I do use a 29.97 frame rate. I also record at that frame rate because that's the max YouTube recognizes. Progressive with a Square Pixels 1.0. After that, you might want to click maximum render distance, but um, I really don't want to increase my render time uh, because I render out long videos. For example, the video that this is right now that, you know, this is about to be rendered is 48 minutes. So it's going to take a little while. I use a VBR2 pass unconstrained bitrate encoding with a 5000 bitrate because I record at actually a 15,000 bit rate and uh, I scale that down 10,000 and it actually does look really good when it does come out so um, yeah it also doesn't make extremely big files it's about a gig an hour um, after everything is all said and done Key frame intervals 5 seconds, buffer size 1 second, and then I also do want to mention that I use maximum render quality and use previews down here because that actually speeds up render times Audio, audio codex is Windows Media Audio Professional 10 at 48 hertz uh, 48,000 hertz because um, I record my videos at 48,000 hertz, so it makes sense to export them at that many hertz. Stereo and 16-bit sample. Under that, we have one pass encoding and constant constant bit rate with 256 kilobits per second bit rate. Actually, you record my audio at an even higher bit rate than that, but again, export. Uh, that is actually um, Adobe Premiere's maximum. And uh, that is actually it. That is all I do to export my set, export my videos, except I do use Adobe Media Encoder rather than direct exporting directly in uh, Adobe Premiere. But nevertheless, guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it answered your questions you had about my Adobe Premiere render settings. That is what I use. That's how I get the quality that I get with my Minecraft videos and even my vlogs. So um, there you guys have it. Anyway, I'm Nix Games, and I'm out, guys. Peace. And here's some videos you guys might want to go check out. On the left is Classic Craft Episode 16. That is my weekly weekly Minecraft series, which I go back and play Minecraft Alpha. I go back, have some fun, build some stuff. It's a really good time. Go check it out. And on the right is Install Forge and Too Many Items at the exact same time in Minecraft 1.7.2. Go check it out. I think you will enjoy the video, especially if you want to install those two mods. Also check out my daily vlogs at Bomb Center of your screen. That's where I document my life every single day. Nevertheless, guys, I'm Nick's Games, and I'm out. Peace.